This is an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar on media compression in Adobe Media Encoder. Hi, my name is Larry Jordan. In this short video, I'll show you how to add overlays, like watermarks, to video during compression. I want to work with effects. There are several effects we can work with. We can add lots or change a Lumetri setting, but I would never, ever, ever do that with a finished master. I would do it as part of DIT work. I could create an SDR version from an HDR master. I can add an image overlay. Let's do that. So click image overlay and let's navigate to training media. Still images, watermarks. I can add either a PNG or a PSD. If you're doing PNG, make sure that the background is transparent, which you create in Photoshop, and we don't see anything. That's because I'm on the Source button. Click the Output button and notice that it now adds my watermark to the video. Scrolling down just a bit, make the opacity 60% so it blends with the background, and now I've got a really nice looking watermark. Well, let's keep going. Let's add a name overlay. By the way, the watermark must be a still, PNG or PSD. Uh, Media Encoder does not work with moving watermarks. If you need to have a moving watermark, you'd have to add it in Premiere. By definition, the name overlay is the name of the source file. You can change that. I'm going to add this My Movie, and I want to have Real 6. Space Real 6. So I can burn in the name of the file, the job, the date that it was shot, whatever text I want to add. And as long as I'm adding stuff, let's add time code burn. Click time code overlay, put it at the bottom center. We can change the size. And now when I output this, it burns in the text, burns in the time code, adds the watermark, and as always, puts it in the compressed files folder. Double click it to open it up. And there is everything we just looked at. The text, the time code, and the watermark. Is that not cool? This was an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar. For the complete version of this presentation, please visit our store at larryjordan.com slash store and look for Webinar 299. By the way, when you need to stretch your training dollars, membership in our video training library saves you money and time. You can access all of our videos for a low monthly price of only nineteen ninety nine. That's more than 1,900 movies on a wide variety of subjects. Plus, premium members can download practice media and projects. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it multiple times each month. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.com slash membership. And thanks.